personally, I use HubSpot CRM to track my email opens and clicks. So I know you might not have replied to my email, but I can see that you've opened something, you've opened it, and you've clicked it. So what do I do if I've sent you three emails, you've opened all three emails, maybe clicked on a link or something to my blog post or something, but you've not replied or booked um, a Zoom call with me or a telephone call with me. But I can see you've opened this email. I can see that there is some interest. What do I do next? Uh, what do you think the problem is? Uh, probably, again, probably your subject line of your email was not added. This person was not impressed by your content. <laughs> yeah? That Ouch. could be one. Okay. Another thing, it could probably they need a product that's not urgent on their end. Okay. So don't uh, give up. I feel at this point, it's always good to uh, look for their contact uh, phone numbers to engage them personally. Because not everybody is good with emails. We are headed in a place where videos and phone calls are going to be very, very important mm -hmm. because not everyone loves uh, responding immediately, especially to emails. But if you contacted this person on phone, uh, on the phone, you would get a, a, you know, direct feedback, whether it's a no or a yes or a maybe. Oh, it's okay. very, very urgent. But for most emails, when they are not responded and they are open, it means yeah. it's either a no or a maybe. Uh, so let's stick okay. to maybe. Uh, if we, if we, if, uh, if we are trying to stick to the maybe, then we need to look at for other channels of communication. And then if uh, it becomes a no, then we can rule the client out. Okay. 